Hello, just two mom here, and today I'm reviewing the Lego Ultimate Battle for Asgard, set number 76084, which is from the movie Thor Ragnarok. I'm reviewing this set because I really like the minifigures. These are the superheroes that are fighting Hela, Fenris Wolf, and the Berserkers for the future of Asgard. As you can see, here is the box. This is the front of the box. And there's the back of the box. Now let's go and review the set. Here's a ship that the superheroes use to save the day. It's really well structured. It has a storage compartment right here. See that? And then a cockpit that you can use to put your minifigure in. I'm gonna put him in without his hair because it's coming off. See that? That's pretty nice. And then you see all these pretty uh, red and black and yellow colors on here. It has a lot of stickers. See that? Okay, and now I'm gonna take out Bruce Banner and put him under so that he can be launched out as the Hulk. All right, you put him on this here. See the upper part? Attach it. Let's see where it goes. You have to make sure the button is pressed on the other side. I'll show you the button in a second. Okay, he's attached. See that? Now, this right here, button, you pull, and it releases him. That's pretty cool. I like that. Let's try it one more time. Let's go. Oh, came out. So he stays on. Yep. Okay. Now you pull this up and he's out. <laughs> I like that feature. It's very cool. Okay. I'm going to be moving on to the minifigures. I'm going to start with my favorite minifigure, Hella. She is awesome. She has this great looking hairpiece. See that? And when you take it off, see her eyes right there on the back of her head? Okay, but you put this battle helmet on and oh my gosh, it's so fantastic looking. Look at that. She looks crazy, which I love. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. And then she has this power blaster right here that you can launch by pinching it. See if I can pinch it on this hand here. Put my hand out of the way. Pinch it right here. Woohoo! I got it. <laughs> and then there's an axe. It's really big. <laughs> okay, and here is her green cape. Love it. And there's the back of her torso. And the front of her torso, it's black and green. She has that green armor right there. So fantastic looking. I love this minifigure. They did such a good job on this. And then she has a stand. I'll put her back here because you can't see when I put it close up, but it's crazy. Look at that, her own stand. Nice, look at that, <laughs> and it moves. Okay, let's move on to Valkyrie. Here's Valkyrie. She's the second minifigure that I like. She has this great face print. See that? Really cool black hair. Looks like a mohawk. I love that. And she has this great looking cape in blue. The side cape. That's pretty cool. I love her torso. That blue and silver. It's beautiful colors. First of all, I love blue. <laughs> and then the blue legging. I love that. The back is blue and silver and her blue legs again. Very cool. And she has a sword. Ready for battle. Nice, I love her color. Overall, this is the second best figure. Let's move on to Thor. Here's Thor. He has a great looking helmet. Look at that. Very nice, you take it off. See his beard, 
front and then the back. Oh my gosh, she looks crazy. He's ready for battle. Then you see his torso and his legs. The gray with the silver. I like that too. Back is gray and silver also. Has this red cape on the side too. <laughs> Very nice looking. And these two power blasters in blue, which are nice. Let's see if I can try to launch one. <laughs> Let's see. I might lose this one because it's going a different direction. Ah! <laughs> see that? Woohoo! Nice. That was pretty cool. Okay, let's move on to Bruce Banner. Here's Bruce Banner. And as you can see, his face is Spider-Man. Well, when I built this set, uh, I was up to the last bag and the head was missing. But what was I to do? I already did the whole set. It's just a head, so I put Spider-Man's head on there. Why not? But everything else is there, as you can see. He has this really cool hair piece. See that? In the back. It's still Spider-Man. <laughs> I don't know why I took it off. And then he has this cool black leather jacket with a gray t-shirt and black pants. Black back also. What else can I say? He's not all there. <laughs> Here are the Berserkers. They're identical. And you can't really see their face. All you can see is like little teeth. That's basically it, and the rest is all green and black. And the back, it's also got some green on the back. They both have a horn in the back. You see that? It's a horn. And they have these cool swords. See that? Let's move on to Fenris Wolf. Yay, I'm riding a wolf. I'm never going to have this opportunity again, so I had to take it. Tony. Here's a Fenris Wolf. You can open his mouth. And close it. You can tilt his head sideways. You can move his legs. See that? Move the back legs too. You can move his tail up and down. You can ride him as Tony was doing before. Oop, he just did a split. <laughs> and let's see if we can put him in different positions here. Let's see. That's cool. He's on his tail. Let's see if I can get anything else. Some crazy positions here. Uh, I'm thinking I'm having too much fun here. Oh, I think you can stay. Nice. Let's push it back a little right here. <laughs> I like this wolf. Look at that. He can lay down. That is so awesome. This is a fun little set. I like the way you can move him and, you know, play with him. Very nice. And Banner is hanging out on him, so <laughs> I think that's pretty cool. So that's the Fenris Wolf. I really recommend this set. It's so much fun to play with. It has great features that all ages would enjoy, and the minifigures are exceptional, especially Hella. Tell me what you think about this set in the comments below. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Bye!